Alright, hello. Welcome back to Undertale Yellow. Uh, this is part 7, I believe, of the series, and I'm very excited to continue. Um, last time I was... Oh, right, I finished up with Feisty 5, and now I'm following North Star and the other Fox Lady. I don't know her name. <laughs> I'm very excited to continue and see what's up ahead. Oh... This is the little farm place that North Star is from. It's supposed to be like a sibling who's four star. Sorry, can't talk. I'm preparing for harvest. Must be one of those wild east folk. Huh? No, I didn't see anything. You can turn the pump on, but your handle. The handle. Wait, what? Put the handle on, but it says your handle. I was very confused. Welcome to Sunnyside Farm. It ain't much, but we call it home. My name is Solomon. You must be from Starlow's Town, eh? I have mixed feelings about it all, if I'm being honest. The boy rarely talks to us, it's a shame. He probably thinks we hate his life choices, but that ain't, just ain't true. It's because of him that our farm saved business during the old drought. His little town attracted monsters to this area after most moved away. I believe that deep down, saving the farm was his true motivation. I do. Oh, well, this is just cute. I wish I sold the corn. Hello again, I have some news. You can, now can ship yourself if you so choose. Ship myself? What could that mean? Transportation? All for free. If you want to travel, give me a call. You will set to the skies without a care at all. Now I must go, but don't be nervous. Just ring the bell for our service. Okay, thank you. Do I have mail? Hello, greetings, hip hip hooray! What can I do for you today? You have a watch? If you don't, that's fine, cause you know what time it is. Mail time, mail time! I truly hope you like your mail. As for me, I must hit sail! What mail did I get today? Dalv letter. I don't even remember what voice it did for Dalv, it's been a long time. Greetings, Clover. Life has been a treat since we last saw each other. Packed up all my belongings and set out for Snowden. I recently found a nice place to settle down. I think you'll like it. Oh, and all the neighbors moved out with with me. I'm not so sure where they where each one went, but I know they are doing well. I'm also taking art lessons from Penilla now. She gave me the cold truth and said my art needed lots of improvement. It stung at first, but uh, then I remembered that I should always aim to improve yourself. Ah, uh, look at me rambling again. I hope the mail service doesn't charge extra for that. It was nice to talk to you again, even if it's over written text. Please visit in the future. Life scheme a lot better. Dalv. Wonderful. I'll have to, I mean, I probably could, like, right now go visit Dal, because that's the, um, the mail service can carry me. Cellar is locked. Does not seem to be anything in the cornfield. I'll go in the house and do everything in there, then go visit Dal, I think. Oh, hello, little one. Are you a friend of my son's? He's always making new friends. I can't keep up. In any case, make yourself at home. Decker rocket ship ready to blast off in Pleasant Dream. See you, Space Cowboy. Thick farmer's almanac written by Solomon sits on the dresser. It has several sticky notes poking out of its pages. So that must be North Star's room. Interesting. Yeah, let me go visit Dalvin before I move on. He said he's in Snowden. Hello, greetings, <laughs> hooray, what can I do for you today? Where on the road would you like to fly? Just choose the place, a new GPS sign. A very fine choice, I cannot scoff, hop in my basket and we'll take off. <laughs> I love the color palette song, I forgot that happened. We arrived without a scratch. The journey was fun, but it's time to dispatch. Just ring the bell for any further assistance. The UGPS will be there with little resistance. Was this near the town? I can't remember. So this guys. Yeah, this is the resort. Oh, there's a mirror. Is that the new hat? Love it. Average eyes probably couldn't tell a change, but my eyes are anything but new. For starters, I can't blink. That's the, um, the mirror I fought. I remember him, actually. It just was a while ago. So where would Dal be? Let's see. Right, that's the back entrance. Uh, hello again. 
the honey dew resort, please look around. Nothing new about gals. Uh, maybe up here. I'm trying to remember where like the actual like buildings and stuff are. But I cannot remember. Oh, I don't wanna get too far ahead. I'm gonna go back to the sign and go back to where I was going. Because the resort's the only place I can actually think of as like a town area, because you don't, can't go to regular Snowden in this game. I'll go down a little bit. I don't think it's down any further, but I'll go down a little bit for, for, further past the sign. It's possible that may have been before the resort. No, yeah, this is just like on the way to... This is like going through empty Snowden. I'm so relieved now. Everyone's on the, everyone's on the ground safe. I wonder if only children have to deal with this. The monsters climbing all over your head, I mean. Hey, where are you going next? Anywhere exciting? Can I come? So these are all the monsters I actually fought in the past. That's so neat. Because those guys were all like toppled on top of each other. Or, yeah, on top of each other, not toppled. <laughs> okay. Hello, greetings. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, no, I don't want mail. I want mail. I miss, I miss click. Miss click. Travel uh, to Oasis Valley. Thank you. Like I do the voice every time. Every time I get mail, because it's like, you know, far enough between. That's not where I wanted to go. That's not where I wanted to go. <laughs> I like how the bell changes. Depending I like how the bell changes depending on your location. Because, um, in Snowden it was like a jingle bell, which makes sense. Oh wow, the East Farm, duh. Um, in the, uh, in Snowden it was like a jingle bell, like a Christmas bell. And over here in the Wild East it's a just cow bell, which makes sense and it's awesome. People. Hey, there they are. There you are. I was about to come looking for you. So, the steam works. Whoa. May I ask why I, why we are here? Because of this. The mask Kanako made or Kanako made for you. Yes. You see, Clover, Kanako is me and Chujin's only child. You haven't seen her around because she. Everything will be okay. I know it's tough for her. Fast is not possible. There's no need because she's alive. I feel the presence to speak. The lab. Precisely. Clever, you know this, but there's a lab in Hot Land. An inquiry for the fallen down was sent out some time ago. I didn't know what else to do. In my time of despair, I sent Kanako with them. It's been far too long and I haven't heard anything. I must travel to the lab to find out where my daughter is. Soroba, stepping out there and taking charge. You've been a rut lately. It was tough to watch. So, so why travel through the Steamworks particularly? It's with this route to Hotland from here. Nothing but abandoned rooms as far as I know. I choose his old passcodes for any locked doors as well. It's all planned. If you need me, I'd be happy to accompany you. I don't know how ugly things at the lab may get. You need to stay here and take care of the town. I believe you owe your Apology. You're right. I'll take Clover with me. They've proven to be skilled in several fronts. An excellent choice. I trust Clover to deliver justice out there. Justice, reference. Alright, we've discussed enough. Let's get moving. Bye, North Star. I'll hopefully see you again at the end of the game or something. I'll see you later, Starlow. Whatever happens, remember that this is for Chujin's legacy. He does share the name of the Mario character. Starlo is the little, like, yellow guy from the Mario and Luigi games. Oh, Clover, before, I get, before you go, I forgot to give you this. The Deputy Badge! It's by a few hiccups, our little adventure was blast. I'll be seeing you around, partner. Hell yeah. 
Hell yeah! <laughs> I'm so proud. Hell yeah! I get the little pose. It's awesome. Remember, I'm in charge. Stay close by and we'll reach your station soon. Yeah, hold, hold on. I want to like look at this thing. Oh, do I only have a fruit cake? up clover we don't have all the time in the world yeah i'm literally running you have longer legs i'm like half your high height i see something follow me oh god i guess i should have expected this and it's prime this is the main power source of the underground that obviously was many years ago until we breathe life back into this thing we can't progress a console here. Maybe one of Chujin's codes will work. Just give me a second. In the meantime, you can go way around the corner or something. I'll explore. Door. Not door. This thing. Nope. Over here. Heart. Like, I can't get it to work. We have to find another route. But I already opened it because I'm cool like that. Oh no, I have to turn on multiple machines, I think. Because our thing is lit up. Yeah. get all of it into the clock that with those ones still being turned on. Oh, so that opened the door. What are those lights on the machine for? Uh, Almost got it. Didn't think this would actually work. Oh, so they are for the machine. I'm just going to the last puzzle now. Got it. Howdy! Another team up? You're wasting your time, buddy. So far, these monsters have only brought you misfortune. I feel like following that lazy orders won't end any differently. Especially with that lab business. Just try your best to move things along, not get sidetracked. Hopefully we can talk soon. Good luck, Clover. Well, I'm glad there's a save point at least. Let's get you saved. Yer. Alright. Ooh, stuff. The chute is clogged with strange looking plants. Doors jam shut. Doors jam shut. Doors jam shut. You find a stick of beef jerky. Hell yeah. I have beef jerky in a long time. The smell of the oil and washed clothes make you feel queasy. Gross. A pair of cargo jeans stuck to the table. It's been there for a while. Stuck to the table. <laughs> <laughs> Peer inside the chamber. It's far too dark to make anything out. Dark. 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 And jump scare. Dark. Alright. I was thinking of the Meatly's comic. <laughs> Oh, surely this will go well. So cool! What's up, lady? Oh my god, this theme is so good! It's working! Wait, what have you been up to? Uh, I wasn't actually doing anything at the same time with that. Ugh, You're clearly more capable of problems, I suppose you should think away from now on. Just head west, here, probably eventually. You got it, lady! God, this is awesome!
Oh my god, it's very pink. My color palette has changed once again. I think so is hers. Oh, it's not right against the wall. Steamworks. I'm so excited for this area. What the fuck? Turn the power on. The whole facility it goes insane. But you're now the leader and all. I'll let you run ahead and turn the steam off. I think I see a switcher there, so no problem, right? Don't worry. I'll catch up. Huh, dodgeable attacks on the map. <laughs> you stun down stairs and you're just like... <laughs> See? No swings. This is such a good thing. Holy crap. <laughs> my girlfriend's been watching my videos and she keeps laughing at me and obsessing over the music. Oh, well there it goes. Anyway, she was laughing at me obsessing over the music. Oh, it's teamwork. Okay. She was laughing at me obsessing over the music. Uh, rather than like the cool art in the game. And this does look incredible, especially like the gears, how like, they do a turn and stop, turn and stop. It's a really good looking animation. Like all of this looks incredible. But the music is what really gets me. I've always loved Undertale's style of music and they didn't copy it, but they re recreated it really well. Excellence in Engineering Award, Dr. Ruthford, Rutherford Oscar. Decency in Engineering Award, Professor Daniels. You tried an Engineering Award, Mr. Chujin could Katsukane. He never told me he won an award. I'm proud of him. Greatness and you can't make out the rest. Greatness and combustion. He just blew it up. Here we go. The creature. Not a creature. The opposite. Axis model 014 ready for guard and attack. Intruder spotted. Steamworks Eastern Branch. Wait. Who are you? Access model 014, ready to guard and attack. I just said that. My vocabulary is not expansive, ma'am. Okay, well, I wasn't thinking you wanted to be here. If you let us through, we'll get, we'll get out of your hair. One, I do not have air. Two, I cannot allow you to pass. You have trespassed on private property. You have also utilized machinery without permission. No, no, we're just heading to Hotland. You aren't malicious in the slightest. It was us who woke up this place. Is it nice to have power? Well, it is nice to be operational again, it is also not nice. I am the last of my kind to police this area. All of my comrades have rusted over. I always knew I was the best, but I am also lonely now. Oh well, I will now trap you in a cold, dark room for which you may you might perish. That's what you should just work here. I have permission. You might be hurt you. Ooh! Jujin, my creator. Huh? Sorry, I do not see him present. Goodbye. Uh, Wait! Yippee! <laughs> what that sound? Uh, Ouch. Can't say I was prepared for that. Uh, I knew my husband was an engineer, but he never told me about that guy. He mentioned a robotics project that could have a promotion, but he stopped talking about it after he quit his job. Ugh. I would have used force to bypass Axis, but I had not. I am. But I. I'm not sure now. Maybe the last remnant of Chujin's talent would be best if I could just, if we could just avoid him from now on. In any case, we're pretty lucky he's the only guard bot around. Wait a second. I have an idea. He mentioned how he was lonely, right? Well, what if we fix that? We could use scraps lying around to forge a companion for him. He doesn't seem too bright after all. Yes, oh, you did What do you think? Yes. Great. It's the best plan I could ever, ever think of. So. Look around for parts we can use. Shouldn't take many. Can we use this? Crap something else then. Well, I don't know. I need to find something good. What does this thing do? Okay, let me look around for stuff. Alarm clock. Definitely. Let me see what else there is though. Bow tie. Ah, easily. The right choice. Uh, I'm not sure what this thing on the floor is, but I can't pick it up. Uh, screen? I guess I think it makes sense. Those three together seem pretty good. Ooh! Uh, that would probably be the right choice, but I don't, I'm not really feeling it personally. Oh, definitely Google, guys. Okay. 
Ooh, guys first. Here you go. Positive. Three more objects. Okay. That's perfect. I was gonna say, if I need to use a robot head, I will, but I think these will be good. Certain. Alright, finally the team. Good. You're gonna run if you run, you drop it. Just your final choice. Yeah. Okay, let's build a robot. No, I don't pick up the giant thing in the background. That's not right. Why would I want to pick that up? Okay, there we go. That's pretty good, I'd say. We got our tiny TV on top. The hat. Oop, I turn it upside down. Yeah, that's perfect, I'd say. All done? Yeah. I'm um, not sure about the design, but okay. That takes care of that. That, 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 that takes care of that. You're kind of creative when push comes to shove. All due respect to choosing work, but this is make full access. So I'll do it for you. Let's get out, let's get out of here, yeah? Door. Door is locked. I think it's up still. Hey, lady, look what I got. You travel with Marlette for the Wild East, right? She's a bit of a tinker, if I recall. Did she teach you anything about building contraptions? You seem to know what you were doing. To an extent. Brick toys! Brick toys, like the little plastic ones. I guess I can see how that would help. My daughter loved those things when she was younger. Not the complex sense of instructions. Typical vlog, she couldn't have to eat. Uh, vent. Vent is a few screws, you can angle it open. Among Us walking sound. <laughs> Can't say that was fun. Must be extra cautious from now on, okay? Now I'm gonna run. What's in here? Oh, this is where we are stopped. Okay, cool. I like her running animation, it's cute. So, a little bit of time. Might go over again today, honestly. I'm not gonna come very far. Wait, another robot? Gee, you're too clean. Let's stain that vest. No way, we can't fight this thing. What if Chujin built me? You know what? You know what? We'll talk later. We'll try this boy around. A little bit of red vents for us. Can I clean you? Offer to give Jandroid a scrub. They seem offended. You are rude. Take this. Yee. What? I got hit, but I didn't do anything. Okay, you know what? I don't. Was I clean? So I was slippery, which made him hit me and get dirty, which made him happy. I don't. I don't know. Maybe. It's a dead end. Looks like we're going to have to. Cool ray. 
the, the, the floor is lava, travelers. I'm sorry to say I failed the game some time ago. So, uh, however, you do not have to. I will ferry you across the lake. This spot doesn't seem delicious. That's new. I say we give it a go. Thank you for your tr trust. With my help, the floor will not be lava. It will just be floor. Just take a ride. New. Oh, it push off and it goes that direction. I want to like see what all is around. There's so much to explore. Oh my god. There's a second screen. Okay, I have a lot I have to do here. We'll start here. Topmost poster is a handwritten letter to King Asgore. This project, while exciting, will, will be quite the undertaking. We will need mining codes and work overtime to provide the necessary materials. Furthermore, a meeting was conducted at the factory. I'm happy to report back to everyone who's on board. There already are many great robot ideas floating around. Cooking, cleaning, re recreation, motivation is through the roof. Though, one engineer suggests we take this further with the protection boss. I'm quite unsure about that without proposition, but you have the final say. In any case, we will see this completed. The rest of the The steamworks are blooming. That means spring is upon us. This time of year, my creator recommends picnic by the river just south of here. It's not my day. <laughs> okay. I assume a lot of this we needed for like a puzzle later on or something. Or just flavor, which I'm fine with. Oh, I was just here. Okay. I think just up would be the last thing done. Right, this is the duck. Did I see a left? Never. In there, okay. Yeah, I guess I wasn't much exploring the thoughts. <laughs> Sucks. No, why did it instantly start? Oh, they'd all stop for a second, like a men's spear. They said they not, though. The ball! Oh, it's not a ball, it's a button. I got excited. Oh, it's nowhere to go. Okay, cool. So I was right, we are going back here. Back in the first room, maybe? No, it was not there. I 
There it is. Oh, wait, there's stuff I can do in here, too. Oh my god, there's so many platforms. If I go to the left, there's more platforms, I'm gonna explode. There's so much to explore. I'm going insane. Upsies. Okay, that feels correct, so I'm gonna go the other way as first. Boba soup to fuel the engine. What? Don't act like you've never heard of it. Okay, buddy. Alright, so this room is just this. I'm gonna try going back to the seats over there. You've reached your destination. Thanks for the help. Let's keep moving, Clover. Be yeah, alright, I'll be here. Okay, so that was the right way. Then I'll go back. I'm glad they have a little bit of dialogue for that, it's really nice. Also, can I get down here? What's... Yeah, okay, no, I can't have to down there. What's up here, then? Oh, God. Oh, hey, Mel. BAM! It's your boy, Mo. How did I get here? I got contacts, alright? Eyes all over the ground. Enough chit-chat, though. It's business time. As you know, I'm always scouting around for the next big thing, right? Right. So I was on my way here and spotted a bunch of glowing plants in the wall. First thought that sprung breath into my mind, taste them. And I'll tell you what, stuff hit me like wham! Best cuisine you ever experienced, truly. Uh, got something. I ain't done with the pitch yet, miss. This is important. But, like I was saying, plants? More than, <laughs> more like fleas. I even molded them into recognizable food chips for that visual appeal. Visual appeal is half the battle, I say. Hey, no, we gonna buy uh, a product looks ugly, right? Well, you would. I know it, old uh, old oak. Uh, count your business. And the whole ocean. <laughs> you okay? They're better, huh? <laughs> now, where's my stand? Have a few products in my pocket. Don't go yet. <laughs> Here's what I got. Uh, I do need actual food though, unfortunately. Grassy fries sounds kind of good. Bye, Mo. Okay, I can't go away. Bye, Mo. I want to get more food, but I want to save up in case there's another defense I might get, because defense is more important than healing. The more defense you have, the less thing you have to do. But if you have low defense and high healing, you're still healing a lot. Anyway, I think that is it for today. I've been thoroughly enjoying this section of the game. This is awesome. And it's nice to have another uh, companion again. I would like uh, Marlette back. I like Marlette more. But this is still fun. Uh, I'm looking forward. I hope there's a co-op battle at some point. I know it's not Undertale-ish. It's more Delta Rooney. But I really hope there's a battle like where I can battle with her against someone else. That'd be cool. Even if I can't control her, like, if it would be cool. But yeah, I'm really enjoying this new area of Steamworks. It's super cool to get a whole, like, pink aesthetic. But, um, yeah, that's all then. Thank you for watching. Uh, next episode should be out tomorrow. Or maybe the day after, I might actually be seeing a friend tomorrow. So, you might, there might not be one tomorrow, but wait and see. Not sure yet. Bye.